Hello everybody and welcome to Snafflewood Toots The show no one asked for last week tonight with Certified Let's go over our main topics Beautiful numbers Beautiful numbers I wake up every morning to these beautiful numbers 153,000 153,000 good Russians 2,400 tanks You can see the numbers on screen Beautiful Beautiful Moving on We got a little bit of sad news Nancy has left us Not to the rainbow or anything But He moved on to a better family I am finally done with IVs. You can see the pictures. The war has seen some serious developments in technology. As seen in this video, these are some high tech Russian tanks developed in the 50s that have anti-ship guns mounted on them careful nato <laughs> careful continuing with the developments in uh, russia we got the geniuses the engineers from the chechen republic they developed this this whatever this is it is a car it is a car has a gun has a gun wow fucking impressive careful there this week we got the prisoner of war fashion week in ukraine Engineers in Ukraine have developed new means of transport of Russian prisoners of war. In the latest intelligence update from Britain saying in late February 2023, Russian mobilized reservists described being ordered to assault a Ukrainian concrete strong point, armed with only firearms and shovels. The lethality of the standard issue MPL-50 entrenching tool is particularly mythologized, myth mythologized in Russia. Little changed since it was designed in 1869. Nice. Its continued use as a weapon highlights the brutal and low-tech fighting which has, has come to characterize much of the war. One of the reservists described being neither physically nor psychologically prepared for the action. Recent evidence suggests an increase in close combat in Ukraine. This is probably a result of the Russian command continuing to insist an offensive action largely consisting of dismounted infantry with less support from artillery fire because Russia is short on ammunition. That was it for this week's edition of Snuffle with the Swoot. See you next week. <laughs>